Hello, and welcome to the last episode of the Austro-Hungarian Conquest in the World War I mod for European War IV. So yeah, I do want to make this the last episode. I was kind of thinking about not doing it, but I just really want to go and, and, and move on. Because if you didn't watch my Let's Talk video, well, I explained it all in there. But anyway, the stuff that went on with my mic and the filter, apparently it is just shipping out today. So it's not supposed to be here today, which I really didn't... I don't know why I expected it to be here today when I ordered it on Sunday. But still, I thought that it said that I was getting here today, but no, it's just shipping out. But it should be here soon, because it has already shipped out, of course. But I would like for this to be the last conquest on European War 4, at least for a while. And then, apparently there is a Glory of Communism mod update that Total War wants me to review. Wait, by the way, it's Total War on my Discord. But they want me to do a review of it. They sent me the mod personally. So I will be doing a review of that. And <clears throat> depending on how fast Amazon is, I don't like that. Uh, yeah, I would like to make that the last video on mobile until my mic and stuff arrives. So that is the current plan. Like I said, I just really don't want to record on mobile anymore. I think that it's time for me to move on from it. But essentially my goal for ending this is just go ahead and drive France and Britain out of the rest of France. Take them out of Spain because for some fucking reason they're still down there. Uh, I don't know about Portugal yet. I don't know if Spain is going to do anything about that. But if they don't, I might just not worry about that. Actually, no. I'll go ahead and send these units down there if Spain doesn't do it. But I'm hoping that they will. Just to go and take that bit of effort off my back. And then, as you can already see, I have a pretty small African force. Or African invasion force. But it should be enough. I don't see why I would need more. And of course, we are taking Sicily easily, and we're about to take Sardinia very easily. So at least this won't turn into a grind like it usually is. Which, I should have said in the Let's Talk video, but that was my main problem with these tech games, actually. Of course, there is a whole thing about the conquest all being the same. But it's also about how near the end of the... Like every conquest, it's always a grind to get like that last city or that last nation. But no, in this, it seems like everything is going pretty damn well. I think that the only problem that I'm going to have is with Egypt, because that is extremely well defended. I am hoping that this new mic will make me sound better in a recording, which of course, that is the whole point. But what I mean is... I found out yesterday that on Discord I actually sound much different than I do on mobile videos. Yeah, somebody that was in the call went in and commented on that. And I recorded a little bit of me talking on the Discord, and yes, I do actually sound a lot better when I'm doing that for some reason, even though it's the same phone mic. So what I'm hoping is that my voice, in terms of deepness, will sound a lot better with this new mic. because. Well, I have said before, I don't like how I sound in my mobile videos. I really don't like it. But I am extremely excited to see that fixed. Because it should go ahead and go over smoothly in terms of being fixed. I'm hoping. I know there will be some settings to work out. But still, it will be worth it. It does appear this will be the last stand of that small Italian and French and... Well, I almost said invasion force there. No. Uh, their naval force. Uh, it's nothing really to brag about for them, but it is still going to be a tad bit of a bitch to clear up because I have units on land that could be attacked. But, ah, uh, wait, oh, wait, actually we have it. I thought that was just going to be just short of that, but no, we have Sardinia. Let's go ahead and make some artillery and just drive them all the way back into Africa. And we are currently invading them. I have a tank 
kind of messing up Tunisia. It's not doing all that much, but it is better than nothing. We are doing absolutely pitiful damage against Barcelona. But I am in no rush. Certainly not in any rush. We can just take our time with this. I would also like to start streaming more, which I forgot to bring up in the intro. But summer is on its way, and I will have like literally every day to just stream, chill out, edit stuff, and just focus a lot more time and effort on Twitch and YouTube. So I will go and leave my Twitch link down in the description. Now while I have been focusing down on Africa and just taking down the rest of these French colonies and all this other shit, well, I don't know why I looked at that and said colony. But like right around here in Egypt and all that. Just taking out the minor places, but there is still one major challenge that I've been trying to avoid. And now I just kind of have to go through with it. It is, it's Britain. They have a lot of units, a lot of defenses. And I don't have a lot of invasion forces that can do that. So I have two generals and one damaged infantry, as well as one random ass German general. So uh, not the best force to invade Britain, but we had to make do. I can't send up anything better for right now until I take out... Well, they really don't have too much left here, but still, I can't just make ships and send them off because they would get incredibly damaged in the process. And with this, the Russians are pretty much done. The remainder of their units are in the lower part of Finland, and just this one dark ah, dock yard, my apologies, right here that we will take care of pretty much immediately. So I'm feeling by maybe what turn is it? Like round 45, 46, Russia will be completely done. Honestly, I expected Cyprus to put up a lot more of a fight, but no, that was actually it. So we'll go and take care of these two coastal forts. It won't be too much of a hassle. And then we are just going to send all of these units from both sides straight into Alexandria. I mean, not fucking out. <laughs> My bad, I meant Cairo. But I'm hoping by the time I get the units that are coming in from Turkey down to Egypt, these units will also be down to, or over to Egypt. That's what I'm hoping for. It probably won't turn out that way, but I don't really see how it matters either way. We're still going to conquer them eventually. The invasion of Africa has turned out to be a lot easier than I thought that it would be. We went ahead and took out Tunisia, and there is an entire unguarded coastline right here. My allies are too stupid to go for it. All of this, it's just right there. I can move up the coast and just take it for myself, no problem. So uh, yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I believe that this should be the last thing owned by Russia. Yes it is. Oh my god, that is beautiful. After slowly wearing down Britain, it seems that I will finally get London. There we are, we finally have a city, and now we can just steamroll over the rest of Britain. Uh, they do still hold a pretty good amount of ships in the English Channel, but I have secured this dock in Northern France, and I'm pretty sure, yes, I have completely taken France. Well, you know what I mean, mainland France. So now we can just keep on sending units and ships well, out from France. So yeah, at this point I would say Britain is just, they can't hold on any longer against this. As much as I talked about Portugal during this conquest, they really didn't turn out to be anything special. There we go, Portugal is done. Spain actually did go in to take their capital as soon as I started my assault. They waited until I put in the effort to do it. It is fucking Spain, so what do you expect? But it seems like all we have left is Britain, this one Italian unit, and a couple of French cities, and that's it. Once again, another area that I really hyped up during this conquest was Egypt. But see, the thing is, I don't think that they were prepared for any type of invasion. 
I just cleared out this entire coastal area, just using the ships, no actual units. So I have a strong feeling that this is just going to be a straight up slaughter. Yep, I was completely right, this is nothing short of just a fucking massacre. We've already taken Cairo, this fort is nearly done already. Actually, we can go and take it out right now. And with all these ships on the coast, just go ahead, pepper down that general, he has nowhere to go. He's just stuck in the middle of that river right there. I have units coming in from the east as well. This is going to be no problem. Well, we've already taken care of it. There is no more Egypt left. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that went a lot more smoothly than I expected. But I do kind of feel bad for them. You know, that entire time that I took down Egypt, I had no idea that that was actually Lawrence of Arabia in Egypt. I had no fucking clue. So uh, yeah, we just killed Lawrence of Arabia, apparently. And we also killed pretty much everyone in Egypt. And I'm pretty sure with this, we have also taken France. Yes, we have. And Italy was, uh, is done as well. I just didn't show that because Germany took them, and that kind of did piss me off, to be honest. The last place that we had to take is England. Well, Britain, whatever you want to say. You know what I mean. And here it is. This should be the last of this conquest. Oh uh, no, they are still hanging on by... Oh wait, actually... We have it. Oh, that feels so good. And a little bit sad as well. You know, it's great to conquer world, even though I can't do it. So, thank you all so much for supporting this conquest. It was a bit of a strange one, but it seemed like you guys enjoyed it, and I did as well. It's one of the few conquests in recent memory that I actually had fun with, I enjoyed all throughout. But, that will be all. Once again, I want to do the Glory of Communism update, mod review, whatever. And then, I will probably be waiting until my mic gets here to do a next video. Or maybe... I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll have to see when my stuff actually gets here if I can estimate. But anyway, I will see all of you next time. Goodbye.